All right, it's time for another Straits Talk, and this week's question was, what's your favorite room in the hotel? How do I tell you what's my favorite room in the hotel? It's like, which is your favorite child? They're all wonderful, they're all different. We have 397 rooms, and every single one is different. But this one kind of sticks with me, one, because of the history, and two, the aesthetics of the room itself. The history of the room is, it's the Vanderbilt Suite, we're connected with the Vanderbilt here at the hotel almost by accident. It's kind of an interesting story. We were built by three transportation companies, and one of those was purchased by the Vanderbilt family. So the company had already committed a third of the building cost of Grand Hotel when the Vanderbilt, William Vanderbilt, purchased it. So consequently, the Vanderbilts were our single largest investor. They had a little over $70,000 in the original hotel. So we built this room to commemorate them, but on other levels as well. Colm Varney is our interior designer. He's done every single one of our rooms. He was friends with Gloria Vanderbilt and he really appreciated the colors that she used. She was an artist, a ceramicist, and many of the colors she used and in their mansion in upstate New York were pinks and orchids and purples and greens, and he was inspired by that. So it was a natural fit to build a Vanderbilt suite and honor the Vanderbilts, their connection with Grand Hotel. Why is it my favorite suite? When we do a suite here, when we do a named room, and we have over 30 of them, Carlton Varney's our designer, and when he does a room, he sends us a rendering, uh, an artist painting of what it's gonna look like. The family that owns this hotel, the Muster family, approve it, and then we do the hard labor, and we build the room itself, remodel it to wherever level it needs to be before it's decorated. Then items just start arriving. They arrive all through the winter, from all over the world, from Carlton Varney, from auction houses here and in Europe, and they're laid out, and then his crew comes and does initial placement, then he comes, Carlton Varney himself, and he does the final placement. And this room is so dramatic to me because when all the parts and pieces of this room were laid out, none of them looked like they should go together. I mean, that's the Carlton Varney style to shock you without clashing. And I saw Venetian art glass and purples and pinks and vivid greens, the black Rococo furniture. I said, I, I hate to say it, but I think Carlton's lost it. This is never gonna work. And it's just one of the many, many rooms that I thought was gonna be over the top. And when you walk in, it works like no other room. Colton Varney goes through little trends, and one of them were the crown beds, so we did the crown bed in here. And one of my favorite Dorothy Draper pieces, the work that she did at the Fairmont Hotel in San Francisco. We have two couches she originally designed for the Fairmont, and the coffee table that's right behind me here. That originally was in the lobby of the Fairmont Hotel. So, taking the historical connection with the Vanderbilts, Colton Varney, our designer's connection with the Vanderbilts, and these bright, vivid, fun colors that represent them, and certainly represent Grand Hotel. All right, thanks for watching another episode of Straits Talk. If you want more information about the suites of Grand Hotel and Carlton Varney Design, hot off the press, and I mean hot off the press, we've had this about three weeks, is that the, it's something that's been in the work for over 20 years. Beautifully illustrated shots of each one of the suites of Grand Hotel and then a commentary by Carlton Varney. For, so for more information, pick this up. And hey, if you have any more questions for me, leave them in the comment box below. Thanks for watching.